Hi guys, I just recorded um, five D stash bags and something happened to my video, my camera quit. So I'm gonna start over. Here we go. This is D stash bags one, two, three, four, and five. Um, if you are interested in any of the items, the bags, uh, email me at mycreativecorner at gmail.com. The first person to email me with the number bag they want in their email uh, will get picked. And I will get a PayPal invoice sent out to you. Um, some of the items may be lightly used, but most are brand new, never, never even opened. Um, all bags are sold as is, with no returns and no refunds. They will be mailed priority flat rate, which is currently $8.55 for the envelopes, the bubble envelopes, um, but that will be included in the price. So in essence, you'll be getting free shipping. Um, thank you, and let's see if this works. If this does not work, then I'll have to find another venue to sell the stuff. Um, and the prices would probably go up because, of course, um, I would have to be paying fees and all that to the store. So, anyway, and it is only open to USA residents, please. I, um, I just can't do international at this time. So, sorry about that. Just USA only. Okay, so, let's start again with bag number one. Oops. Okay, so here we have a big stencil by Sheena Douglas at Crafter's Companion. It's eight by eight. It looks like this. So it is a rooftop chimney. It's never been opened, never been used. They do have more in their things if you could probably find them on eBay or something, I don't know. So that's what it shows. Um, there's another stencil. It's from Imagine, Imagine, Imagination Crafts, okay? And, um, there's two Holly stencils in there. Another item. Oh, there's two of these. I haven't used these yet. I've got several. Um, they're called Magic Cuts from Imagination Crafts. Okay, that's what it is. Laser cut velvet board images. So this one has um, some France, Paris items in it. And I don't know what all is in there. Um, and then this one looks like feathers. The words fly and dream. So contains two laser cut velvet boards. That's what that says. Okay. The next item are some cute little stamps for Christmas called Christmas Tree Elements, Winter's Tale. So they are rubber stamps at the end of these little wooden, I don't even know what to call those, <laughs> wooden block stamp set. It says high quality. So there's five stamps and two acrylic stamps. So that's what they look like. Cute. There are some flowers in here, paper flowers, in white, so you can color them with alcohol markers, um, ink, whatever. Here are some inline skates, 2 inches by 2.2 inches. Never been opened again. This is from Tonic Studios. These two are from Crafters Companion in their nautical collection, Fancy Shells and Seafoam. One has two dies, one has four dies. That's what they look like. Very nice. Okay. So this one, I am asking for $15 shipped. And um, I said it on the other video, but I'll say it again on this one since I can't put that one up. Um, I might look for some small items to shove in some of these bags extra 
but it's not a given. It's not a promise. It's just a maybe. Okay, so here we go with bag number two. Again, so number one was 15 shipped. Okay, start with the larger items. It's a 3D embossing folder from Crafter's Companion. It is called Guard a Country Garden. This is what it looks like if you put the um you know guys I can't think of it. The metallic stuff on it. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm trying to do this in a hurry because I wasted all my time on the other one. So that one's a 5x7. This one is a 2.75x7.75. It's called Queen of Hearts. That one's cute. Looks like this. Here is a stamp, um, a die set, sorry, called Concept Die Butterflies. It's a create a card. And even though I opened it, I have duplicates. So I put this in my stash. I put it on magnetic sheet. Um, comes with these two. I don't know if you already have a butterfly accessory pack, but um, you can always try eBay if you don't. I don't think I do. I think I just have these, these dies, but they kind of go 3D looking. Okay, so that one is open, but never used. Okay, and then here's another one. This one also is um, open. Never used it though. I found it, I already had it in a kit. So it's a little trees and some grass called Country Lane. And the size is 2.75 by 2.75. Here we have some stamps and dies. It says celebrate, a bunch of sayings. So it's gonna look like this. It's your special day uh, with lots of cake. It's your birthday, new beginnings, good times together. It's time to and let's. So celebrate and then you put the stamps um, on there if you want or just use the thing. But you can always YouTube, search on YouTube for these and you would just put in um, Gemini, let's celebrate stamp and die or something, see if something comes up. So just search for things if you need to find out how to use them. This is a stamp and die set called Dandelions. So um, you can either do it, stamp it, and then cut it out on the edge of a card, or you can just stamp it on paper, um, or you can just cut it all out. So that's what's included in that, 4.1 inch by 5.8 inches. Hmm. I don't think it's that big, but, huh, okay. Just going by what they put. Here's an embossing folder never used, but it's a duplicate. Some of these I take out and I put in my stash and I don't realize that I already have them. Um, I believe it's by Crafter's Companion, but I'm not absolutely sure. Here we have a Stampin' Die set called Thank You. And here's a little flower and then all the dies. And again, I have duplicates, so I put it on a magnetic sheet. And here's all the dies you get. So... And I put it in a little plastic bag, but never used. This is a pretty cool um, die set. It's called Window Arches. So you can cut arches out of your card fronts. And so there's two dies in that. And you can use the little peekaboo characters um, that they have. Four inches by three inches is what that says. Okay, and one last one. It's called Silhouette Flamingo. Very cute. Four inches by 2.7 inches. Again, that's just a die. Never used, but opened. Um, because I have two. Or more, I don't know. So anyway, so that is number two with all the items in there. That is gonna be $28 shipped. So, only about not even twenty dollars for all those dies in there. Um, bag number three. 
and guys, I pay for all my items. I don't get free things from anybody. Um, these are all bought with my money. So, here's number three. Okay, so here we have a Stampin' Die set called In Bloom. These are photopolymer stamps. They have some. They look like this. Very nice set. Um, they're numbered, so you work with them in like layers. It does come with these dies. Let's see those. I guess you can. Um, let me put back in there. Again, brand new, open, but brand new. Okay, so that's that one. Here is a 3D embossing holder called Ornate Lace. Very nice. Kind of up close. Uh, five by seven. Here is, I'll oh, do this one. These are nine metal dies called Create a Card Decorative Edges. So you can cut out some edges on your cards just with a die. Very simple. There's nine of those and they measure up to 5.5 in length it says. Okay, then we have a flamingo. It's just a stamp set. I don't have any um, dies for these. I know they're out there. Um, I believe I did finally get a set. So I'm giving away my extra flamingo who is really cool on their own. I don't know, this is probably how they sent it to me with this extra tape on it, but um, I've never used it. Here is a classic birthday cut and emboss folder. Very, very nice, five by seven, so that means it cuts and embosses. Nice. This one is Flower Garden Photopolymer. Again, guys, photopolymer is um, so nice to stamp with. So there's that one. Here are some stamps that are says clear acrylic. So if it says clear acrylic, um, they're not photopolymer. But it's in script, tiny script. I can barely see that, I don't know. But it says that it... 4.1 by 5.8 inches so I've never opened it and this one is the last one in here called beautiful flower also photopolymer finished stamping result could look like that again these are layered you stamp them in um, order okay this is box number three and it's gonna be 35 shipped and again there's a lot of items in here. Really good price. Okay, five, four. Tonic Studios. Okay. So here's one. It's a large set. It's called Wilderness Adventures Fanciful Forest. It contains 25 dies. It's really, really cute. Here's a fox. Largest die says 3.9 by 5.4. So it's like a fox is in there, the trees, a log. You get a little hedgehog looking thing. Um, looks like a squirrel and an owl. So those are very, very cute. Okay. And is this open? No, I don't think so. Um, Hello Sailor, um, the pinup is si sized 3.1 by 5.4, and it says six metal craft dies. So she's gonna look like that. Here 
is another small little die set and it's called birthday wishes so looks like this here's one contains four dies 2.3 by 2.9 it says on your special day or always and forever special occasion another one bright and groom it's just one die 3.5 by 1.2 it's stuck in there so I can't move it but never use never open and then this one is a set of six but it makes three layered it says celebrate make a wish and happy birthday to you and I've made these up as samples before and they're really really cute not this one I have another set so that is bag number four Uh, $23 ship. And the last one for right now. Bag number five. This one actually is just one item. It's from Diamond Press. Um, I bought it and then I bought it early from craft before craft day was on one time. And then um, I switched to auto ship, so I was going to return it, and I never did. So it's an extra set, never been used. I'll just pull these out. Here are the dies. Windows, kitty cat, some grass, some... Here are the dies, beautiful. Friend. Hello, sunshine. Some birds, a plant. Yeah, plant is so cute. Bird on a branch, a chair. The other stamp set. A tree. Um, looks like some pine trees. There's like a farm. Get well soon, thinking of you. It comes with a regular or key size folder, A2, and a small folder. I'll just show you these real quick. So these are the dies. Here's some examples. And you cut several to make a sliding wall. Okay, so that's what that looks like. And okay, let me get it back in here. Again, I have the auto ships, but I'm not getting rid of them. I just didn't send this one back in time when I should have. Okay, so that one, guys, is going to be 30 shipped. So it's the price I paid, um, and then you guys will get free shipping on this. So, anyway... There you go. Um, again, there are the prices. The faster these sell, the faster I can get some more items up. Or I'm going to have to find another venue to sell them cheap so that all, all my money isn't just totally given away to store fees and all that stuff. So, anyway. Um, if you're interested, just remember to email me at mycreativecorner at gmail.com and I will, um, uh, I will post on the thing update if any have sold out, um, after a little while. If they are all sold out by Monday, by the weekend, I will get them out Monday as I have to run an errand. And so I already have someone to watch my mom. So I'll get them shipped on Monday. Okay, guys. Thanks so much. Bye now.